Hello again. We've got some very windy conditions at the moment across the northwest of Scotland. Gusts up to 70 miles an hour plus and accompanying the gusts of wind is this weather front which is going to bring in some heavy rain. But high pressure is still firmly in charge in southern areas. So here are things more settled. That is when we lose this morning's mist and fog. Some of it will be slow to clear, but it should eventually all clear, leaving a dry day with a bit more cloud coming in at times across parts of southwest England and also Wales. These are our temperatures, around about 7 to 10 degrees. Now that band of cloud and rain coming into the northwest spreads further south during the rest of today and overnight. Behind it, we see a return to some cold conditions. Wintry showers piling in above about 200 metres across the north of Scotland and still very windy here. Not quite as cold in the south as it was last night. So tomorrow, here's the dregs of our weather front across southern England. The blues representing all the cold air following on behind, but it is going to be short-lived. So we start with the cloud across the south. You might just get the odd spot of rain from it, not much more than that. A lot of dry weather, a fair bit of sunshine, still gales across the north of Scotland, slowly easing through the day, and the wintry showers, the snow level will tend to rise through the day as well, but in between, a lot of dry weather. Friday sees two weather fronts crossing us and the mild air coming in from the Atlantic, so change once again in temperatures. So here's our first weather front producing some cloud and some rain. The second one brings heavier rain in across northern Scotland and once again the winds here will pick up. For western areas, there'll be more cloud, a little bit of dankness in that. For the south and east, we are looking at some sunshine after a cold start and highs up to about 12 degrees in Aberdeen. On Saturday, it's still a fair bit of cloud around. There will be some brighter skies, especially in eastern areas, but the cloud will be thick enough in some western parts just for some drizzly bits and pieces. And somewhere along this east coast, we could easily see a 13 degree. But generally, most of us are going to be in double figures. High pressure clings on as we head on through the course of the weekend. So although we'll start some mornings with some mist, some fog patches, there will be a lot of dry weather. Any dampness is likely in the northwest.